You know, just a couple words about last week. Certainly, it was a positive start. As, as President Mason said, we were on the road, which was a good thing. We had to get on buses, travel, and uh, go through all the logistical uh, parts of being on the road. But, uh, certainly, when we got to the stadium, it was like being uh, at home. Our fans were just absolutely fantastic. Any of you that traveled up to Chicago, we certainly appreciate you supporting the team and uh, obviously looking forward to being home tomorrow. Uh, it was a tough football game. We anticipated that going in. Northern's uh, got an excellent football team. And, uh, we, we knew it would be a tough, uh, tough contest. Certainly proved to be that. And I thought really the best thing about the entire game uh, was the way we won the game at the end. Uh, it was all, all three phases, offense, defense, and special teams being involved. John Mikey, a fifth-year senior, has worked really hard. Great to steal another fifth-year senior. Probably come out and play the game there. So that, that was fantastic. And then we uh, finished it out. So uh, it was certainly a full 60-minute game. And President Mason started talking earlier. Uh, I think we can probably anticipate more of those. So just kind of you know put your seatbelt on there. Uh, it's the nature of the season. You know, we're, we're uh, excited about being back uh, home tomorrow. Uh, it's always great to be in Kinnick and, and unusual not to be there for our opener. So uh, I think all of us are eager to get there. Uh, our captains are the same this week. We've got James Vandenberg, James Ferentz uh, on the offensive side, Micah Hyde, and James Morris on the defensive side. So uh, four guys that have done a great job in the program over the years. Our honorary captain, uh, and he gave out a, a Marshall Yonder jersey this morning. Marshall's one of the toughest competitors we've ever had play uh, in the program, and we're bringing another one back tomorrow. Matt Roth will be our honorary captain. And, uh, interesting enough, <laughs> Matt, Matt's one of the few guys that uh, has left. It seems like every year we'll have one guy that uh, goes to the pros, doesn't finish his degree. Matt was one of those players. Uh, Dallas Clark came back several years ago and finished his degree work, and that's what Matt's doing right now. He's in town uh, living in Iowa City, uh, he and his wife and a young boy, and uh, he's going to finish his degree here over the next two semesters. So it's great to have him back in Iowa City, and certainly we're looking forward to having him uh, today. So uh, excited about that. And then President Mason mentioned the throwback uh, uniforms, which uh, you know we are throwing way back. Uh, but really, the story behind that is uh, just a phenomenal success those two teams had, the 21-22 teams, uh, both going 7-0 and all being on dispute of Big Ten champions. So it's really a, a privilege for us to honor those teams, and I think the players are excited about that. Uh, Iowa State's coming off a very impressive win against a very good Tulsa football team, and uh, you know they look to be the strongest team that we've played since Coach Rhodes has gotten up there. Uh, they look very uh, uh, polished on offense, and uh, the quarterback's a lot more confident. Uh, we didn't do a great job against them. We certainly have to improve our play uh, in that regard. Defensively, they uh, they look very uh, again very comfortably got a system. And players play very well and they play very well on special teams. So and we've got a big challenge on our hands. Certainly, uh, it's one that we're looking forward to. And uh, the one thing I know when we get to Kenny tomorrow at two thirty or come out on the field. The fans will be more than ready. We have to do our job, and that's uh, that's what we've been working on all week. But the guys have worked hard. Our team's worked hard. Going back to uh, January, quite frankly, and. Uh, they worked hard this past week, so we're, we're eager to take the field and uh, you know, see how we match up against a very good Iowa State team. Oh, it ought to be an excellent football game. It's kind of been the tradition of this series, and, and I would imagine tomorrow will be the same thing. So the team that can really uh, do a good job in those sticky situations will be the one probably that comes victorious. So we're, we're excited to be back. Our fan support has been fantastic. We, we greatly appreciate that. And we'll look forward to seeing you in tomorrow. And, uh, Go from there. We're eager to go, and I know you are too. So we'll we'll see you tomorrow at 2:30. Thanks very much.